the stars Pull one down for you Shining on my heart What this thing has really done for me is giving me the confidence that there's other people like me around the world trying to help the environment and, and working to help climate change, you know? And where are the youth and where are we going to be having to face the problems that climate change poses in the future, where are future decision makers. So it's important that we network now and like share ideas on a more honest one-to-one -one approach. Only in my dreams, and I can change. to have so many youth who want to make positive changes and who want to take responsibility for our future. I'm really excited to be part of this. We all want to make a change and that's a great value to have. Actually, I'm enjoying it. Different backgrounds, different thoughts, different things. Today we've just drafted out our declaration and by tomorrow we're going to finalize it and I bet it's going to be a wonderful declaration and I thank all the organizers for so much wonderful work they've done. So we've come here today, together today to send a message to the delegates that are up there negotiating our future that we need strong commitments on climate change. We need to come together as a whole world to deal with this issue. We can't do it alone. No country can do it alone. We have to work together on this one. Our responsibility from those three minutes is to tell them, thank you for what you've been doing, but it's not enough. And if we don't take a firm stand like this, I think we're wasting our three minutes. So we added urgency, we added concrete targets, 30% by 2020, 80% reductions by 2050. We added the ask for youth constituency. We added um, a human rights-based approach.